Mezzanine divides our marketing services into two pieces, planning and implementation, although one typically transitions into the other. During the planning phase, we take the client through three steps. The first is a kickoff workshop, the second is external market validation, and the third is building the actual marketing strategy and plan. When it comes to implementation, that involves a team of marketers actually going on site to execute the plan that we build. So during the kickoff workshop, we bring together all of the key team members from the client side with the mezzanine team. Uh, this workshop format really allows us to do three different things. First, extract all the organizational knowledge from people's heads and get it into a shareable format. This really helps us get up to speed on the company. And secondly, it also helps us to identify very quickly if and where any knowledge gaps exist, whether it's on the customer side, the market side, or the competitor side. The last thing that the workshop allows us to do is to really build the client's organizational competence around marketing planning. So if it does come time for them to do it again, they need to have a better idea of how they can actually approach it. The second part of the planning process is market validation. During this phase, we actually go to market to validate what we've heard during the workshop. So to do this, we'll conduct interviews with prospects and clients to find out what their pain points are, why they buy, and how they learn about new vendors so that we can bring that additional insight to the table when it comes time to actually build the marketing plan. We also do a marketing audit on both the client, so in terms of what types of marketing activities the client has done in the past and how effective they've been, and then also a marketing audit on some of their key competitors, just to understand how the client is positioned relative to those competitors, what best practices are being used when it comes to marketing in that particular industry, and where the opportunities are for the client from our perspective. So the next step is to actually build the marketing plan. During this step, we combine all of the information from step one and step two, so from the workshop and the market validation, to really turn it into an actionable plan for the client. So the first part outlines the strategy, including how we're going to position the client to differentiate them in the marketplace, what target markets we're going to go after when it comes time to actually execute on the plan, and what our overall market approach is, including both goals and objectives. The second part of the plan is the tactical part, and this is the real meat of the plan. This is where we actually outline what tactics we're recommending in order to meet the company goals. We outline the budget that's required for those tactics, a calendar of what's going to happen when, and what metrics we would use to evaluate success. When we talk about metrics, we talk about both hard metrics and soft metrics. Hard metrics being those real ROIs, you know, how are we going to impact sales, how many leads are we going to get, and the softer ones are those activity ones where it's about whether we're creating content, and if so, how many pieces. We recognize that there are literally hundreds of different tactics that a company can choose from, whether it's revising sales collateral, developing a lead nurturing process, executing some public relations, and we know that it can be overwhelming to just know which ones to choose. So we remove that headache and propose only the tactics that will meet both your goals and your budget requirements.